The Small Business Administration's Paycheck Protection Program started Friday, but the SBA just released initial guidance to credit unions and banks about the new loan late Thursday evening. Because this just launched today, we are getting up to speed just like everyone else is. We are just doing our best to sift through that information as quickly as possible and, and begin to process these applications. Community First Credit Union is one of many in the area anticipating an influx of loan applications. We have clearly fielded hundreds of calls on these at this point. The Paycheck Protection Program is a federal $349 billion loan available for any small business with less than 500 employees. It's a very low interest loan and if you use it to keep staff on primarily, most of it's going to be forgivable so it's an excellent option for uh, small business owners that really need help right now. But certified financial planner Tony Drake and Community First Tim Hoff both say because of this quick rollout, many things are still getting worked out. Lots of banks are have not gotten their systems up and running. The ongoing process and the administering of these loans is still an evolving situation. Right now, the loan is first come, first serve through June 30th. So many advise small business owners to apply sooner rather than later. I would encourage companies to apply for everything right now. The Greater Oshkosh Economic Development Corporation has offered its own loans to help small businesses through this pandemic. You're not going to probably get all of the money that you need or all the money that you want during this period. So you're better off applying for more than what you need at this point. The importance of supporting small businesses through this difficult time is recognized. Those businesses are, are key to the, the vitality of this community. But those trying to get that help to small businesses are asking for a little patience. We've got a job to do and we've got efforts to serve and a community to serve. So our team has really rolled up their sleeves and, and worked very hard. There's going to be some long days and nights ahead, but uh, we're going to get the job done. For more information on the program, visit WBAY.com. Dakota Sherrick, Action 2 News.